Hi guys, Anthony here from The Hot End. Um, you might have seen my previous video where I had a quick overview of craftware. Okay, so this video I'm going to give you a quick overview of uh, Cura 2.1 Beta or Beta. So here it is here. Now there's a few things I want to go over. It's not as straightforward as you would think. So here's the screen that we are greeted with. But um, the tricky part comes now when we want to add our own printer that is not an Ultimaker or isn't in their list. So, add a printer. Okay, I can't afford an Ultimaker, so I'm going to go other. Okay, I don't know what half of these printers are, and I want to make a new one. Ah, oh, I can't, there's no option. Fail. Okay, so the only way to get around that. is to, per the Ultimaker website, we have to hack their own code to get it to work. Which I think is a bit of an epic fail, but we'll do it. Alright, so first off we need to, this is for Windows 10, or it'll be the same for any Windows. Uh, Windows key R, let's go to a run box, and we want to go to C. Program files. Uh, it'll be x86 if you're not running the 64 bit version. Then we want to go to Cura. Then we're going to want to go to Resources. Then we've got to go to Machines. And then you're going to get a big list of all of the, the machines that are in Cura to start with. And obviously we didn't have one, so now we have to make our own. So I'm going to make one for the JG Aurora, which I've already done, so I'll call this one JG Aurora 2. So I'm going to pick the closest thing I could possibly come up with, but I suppose it doesn't really matter, because you're going to build it from scratch. So we want to make a copy. Yes, we want to do it. Continue. And now we have to rename this to something that doesn't exist in the list. So. J G Aurora if I can type the Aurora 2 yes I am the admin just do it okay now that's not it now we have to edit the file so I'm using notepad plus plus because it um, formats the code for you nicely now in here per the Ultimaker instructions we need to alter the following the ID has to be something unique so JG Aurora 2 the uh, what do we got platform file f that's all bullshit I'll show you how I do it okay so this is going to use Marlin Sprinter so I'm going to change the name to uh, what is this 603s or something like that can't remember what the model is that'll do I don't have a PNG file for the background for the printer I don't care what any of this crap is this is what I care about so mine is 300 mil by 200 by 200 high uh, deep so 300 by 200 200 is mine its center is not zero because I'm not running a Delta and I have a heated bed so that's true nozzle size is 0 0.4 filament is 1.75 and the rest of that crap is just don't need to touch it it's fine so we'll save that Okay, so now that's saved. Bang, done. So the next step. Now that we've stuffed around with our files, now we can actually start Cura. And we'll go into printer. 
add printer other and now we should have our Aurora 2 oh no I called it 603 s that's right so there it is there bang okay so that's the printer I've got now that was a pain in the ass to get working to be honest out of all of the slices I've used that is the biggest pain in the ass the rest of this uh, walkthrough slash overview I'll do properly this is just a quick update if you wanted to have a play with the beta if you want to try and um, keep up with what I'm doing at the moment I'm testing as you would have seen in the previous video I am testing these guys Simplify 3D Craftware and the latest version of Kura Beta if you like this video give it a thumbs up share it with your buddies and uh, the next videos you will see will be more than likely the test prints which I'm doing currently on each of the slices and they're 10 to 12 hour prints each so none of this little test cube rubbish these will be big complicated prints I forgot to show you a little bit of bonus footage now do you remember how long it took to render a file in both of the other ones 10 seconds and 2 seconds off the top of my head let's load this file shall we now keep in mind this was near instantaneous in both of the other two slices scale through uh, HD scale I think I might go paint the wall Way, nearly there bang awesome now it's preparing to slice hasn't started yet okay the other one would have been I'll say the longest was 10 seconds one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 11, 12, 13, four, I'm giving up. It's not even quarter of the way through. You get the idea. Alright guys, I shall see you in the next video.